Good evening. Welcome to the Newton County Board of Education special call meeting. I need a motion to amend the agenda to remove items three and four relative to the superintendent recommendations in the executive session. So move. Second. Have a second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Unanimous decision. And uh, Ms. Fury. Okay. Um, so this evening we'll be um, reviewing our um, rollback hearing presentation and Ms. Robinson will be conducting um, the presentation which will appear behind us. Good evening. <laughs> Tonight we're here to discuss the proposed millage rate for the FY17 fiscal year. Uh, we are proposing a millage rate of 20 this year. So on this first slide we have a nine-year history of the MNO tax digest. These are the actual ta tax digest numbers um, from 2009 through 2017. We just received the 2017 tax digest a couple of weeks ago, and it came in at um, two point, just over $2.1 billion. Um, at a millage rate of 20, that would generate about $43.3 million, which is still less than what we brought in in 2009 at a millage rate of 18.21. So I'll give you all a minute to look over that. If you have any questions, um, feel free to ask. The red is the difference. Yes. So we're still $10.4 million less than what we brought in in 2009. It's, it's improving, but at a, at a slow pace. So hopefully we will continue to move in the right direction. Here we have a calculation of um, what a homeowner would pay if they have um, an average home value of $125,000. So in FY17, they would pay approximately $920 at, a, at the proposed millage rate of 20. Um, in 2009, at the millage rate of 18.21, the taxpayer was paying um, approximately $1,075 when you take into consideration the MNO and the bond tax millage rates. For 2017, the bond millage rate is going to be zero. That was lowered um, last year during our budget, session, budget, budget season. So in 2017, a homeowner with a $125,000 home would pay $154 less than what they paid in 2009. Here we have um, various districts throughout the state of Georgia. We have their millage rate, their MNO millage rate, as well as their bond millage rate, and then the total. Um, as you can see, Newton County is down near the bottom at 20, 20 total mills, along with Clark County. Um, some of our neighboring districts are, are above us. Um, you can see Rockdale up there at the top at 25, and Walton is 22.6 mills. And Fayette, which is um, similar to us in size, their total millage rate is 21.350. And again, we did lower our bond millage rate um, last year, so we are at zero for our bond millage rate. This slide may seem a little familiar. It was in our budget uh, presentation. This slide shows our per pupil expenditures, and this is for FY15, which is the latest data that is available. Um, Newton County has a per pupil expenditure of 
$8,297. Um, so that would put us right in between Jasper and Fayette counties um, as far as any ranking among the counties that are listed here. Here we have um, a sample teacher salary. This is based on a teacher at a T4 with 10 years of experience. Um, for 2009, you'll see what their salary and benefits um, were. And then we have 2015, 16, and 17. And our goal is to get back to where we were in 2009. Um, we are not there yet, but we are making progress. Um, as of 2017, with our 1% um, permanent pay increase, we are still $2,700 below where we were in 2009. But much of that does have to do with the 403B and the health insurance contributions that were, were able to be made in 2009. Are there any questions? There are no questions from the board members. Uh, now turn it over to other matters, Ms. Samantha. Yes. Um, other matters of interest. Just for the record, um, school begins uh, July 29th, Friday, July 29th. Um, and all offices will be closed on Monday, July the 25th, and reopen at 1 o'clock because we'll have our opening session at Springfield Baptist Church where the entire school system will be at the church for the opening session. So the everything will be shut down and then we'll reopen at 1 p.m. Um, for regular business. And that is it, Mr. Johnson. Okay. Uh, no other questions, I need a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion have it. Means adjourn.